Good morning. Good morning. We are back and we are at Kings Island. Where's it at? Right Signs over there. there. Yeah. That. And we have the Eiffel Tower behind us. We are in Cincinnati. We're at Kings Island for the day. I've never been here before. So Jenna's be first time. Uh, I've been here. It was like 15 years ago. So I'm so assuming. You've never been here either. <laughs> I'm assuming there's a lot of different things. So we are excited. There's a build a bear. There's a build a bear. I don't believe that we are allowed to take this on any of the rides, like film any of it, um, but we will kind of tell you about what we think of each ride, and we are excited. Show you some of it from the ground level. Yeah, we'll show you. Um, we'll, we're going to eat all the food. We're going to ride all the rides. Plus, last time we were on a ride with our phone, we almost dropped it. Yeah, so not a good idea, but we are going to go explore. We're going to go get on some rides. We're going to have fun. It's going to be good. It's a nice day. Woo! Woo! First ride of the day, Banshee, right there. So we can't video on the ride, so we're gonna put these in a locker and we'll let you know what we think in a few minutes. So we just got off of Banshee. That was a really, really fun ride. Oh my God, it was so much fun. Yeah, we only waited like maybe 10 minutes for it. Quick, quick wait, um, a lot, a lot of fun. And then actually right after that, we ran over to, it's called The Bat. We rode that. I wouldn't ride it again. Um, I wouldn't ride it again. I don't really know how to describe it unless you've been to Cedar Point. It's very similar to Iron Dragon. Yeah, you're in like little buckets. Yeah. Um, it was a very slow start. Um, very quick ride. It was maybe, maybe 30 seconds if that. But the Banshee was the smoothest ride I've ever been on. Yeah. Like, right there behind me. But yeah, it was smooth. A lot of fun. Uh, maybe if there's no wait later, we might ride it again. But we'll see. We're going to go see what else. Is it the park? Yeah. We're gonna try and ride as much as we can. Next ride we're headed to is the Racer. So again, another very similar ride to one at Cedar Point. But we'll let you know what we think. So we just got off the Racer. Oh. Literally. I feel like I got a concussion. I think I lost my boots. That hurt so bad. And also, I'm disappointed because only one of the tracks was operating, so like that defeats the purpose of it being a racer. A racer. So, I mean, but that's beside the point. But I don't think I will ever ride that again. It hurt. My head hurts. My back hurts. So Just we're hurts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're gonna we're Get gonna some water. we're gonna go walk around for a minute. So there's part of the ride as we're waiting in line. I'm gonna see if I can get one of the cars coming through because it looks like it goes pretty fast. So we'll sit here for a second and see if one comes through. There it goes. Hi. We just got off the back lot stunt coaster. Mm -hmm. It was so much fun. It was a lot faster than I thought. Yeah. Like speed I was not, and quickness. Like the very beginning of it, I was not prepared for how fast it went. I thought my head was gonna fly off, mm. but it didn't. No. So we're good. It was but quick. It was a very fun ride. I would definitely ride it again. Mm -hmm. um, but right now we are eating some lunch. We have some pizza and some breadsticks, and you know, free water. Free water. Yeah. So we're gonna take a little bit of a break, eat our food. And then I think we're gonna ride the the antique the cars. Antique cars, yeah. Yes. Let our food digest, and then we're gonna I don't know find a, a roller coaster or a water ride. We're actually doing really good. We've only been here for like two hours, and we've ridden five rides. Yeah. So that's really good. Yeah. Compared to last time we were at Cedar Point, I think we yeah. rode three. Yeah. All day. All day. Three all day. So yeah, we're doing really well. Yay.
So as our walk was heading towards the front, we came across one of the arcade games called Goblet Toss, and they have the cutest little otter. Look at, I need to take him home. They have a ton of like arcade games over here. I love arcade games. Here's another picture of the backlot ride that we were on earlier. And then you see the Eiffel Tower, that is uh, like a little observation deck up on the top, so we'll check that out a little bit later. So we're just going to kind of mosey through the little arcade section of the park here. take home your own giant piece of bacon, just take a pit stop over at your local peach basket and you can take one home today. just got off the water ride that was so much fun it, it's kind of short it just takes you up and then back down again but we got soaked jenna's butt's wet my yeah. butt's wet um it was a lot of fun though if it's hot i definitely recommend riding it which is you know like today it's like 90 degrees i'm hot sweating it's great we're having a great time let's go ride more rides okay Right now we're up in the Eiffel Tower. The Eiffel Tower is about one third. So let's see what we can see. You got the racers that are actually racing. For once. Over here that we just got off of not too long ago. Back lot. So you can see everything up here. And then if you have kids, this is Snoopy Land. You know. Looks like they have a lot of really cute Planet Snoopy. Over there is the water park that we're not going into today. It's also very windy on this side. Might have to pull over. So the water park's over there, Soak City. I don't remember what this ride is called. But when we ride it, I will tell you. So it's on its way up right now. This one's the Banshee, that's the first ride we rode. Super smooth ride. Oh yeah, and you always need to see the parking lot. Look at the parking lot, look at it. It's so beautiful. I wonder if 
wonder if I could find my car. Uh, right over there, if you also want to have extra fun, is Great Wolf Lodge. So you could stay there and then I guess walk over here and... It's Planet the Snoopy! And it's Winston! You never see Winston anywhere! You never, never see Winston. No, I know a lot of these are for kids, but if we can ride any of them, we are going to. Are we? Because I love rides. Okay. Cool. Look at how cute that is. I don't know what it is, but it's really adorable. We're going to check out the Snoopy Boutique. Jenna's really excited. Look at the really cute hats. Hello. They have all kinds of things in here. Hats, t-shirts. Stuffed animals, hoodies, candy, baby clothes. <laughs> Jenna's really happy because they have Winston mugs and Snoopy mugs. Look how cute. So in this store, they actually have their own version of these spirit jerseys. Uh, they have a few different colors. On the front, it looks like it's just um, Snoopy. And then on the back, it says Snoopy. I don't think it's actually a spirit brand, but it's similar. And it's really cute. What did you find? Wait, hold on. I get it. It's supposed to chirp, but I don't know how. It's a Winston. But it's supposed to chirp. It's a Winston. Winston. And they also have poop hats, if you want a poop hat. Flying Ace. So this is the ride we just got off of. It was really cute, really tame, but it is a kid's ride. Um, we, we enjoyed it. There was a couple little kids on there that enjoyed it as well. So we're going to head back towards uh, the newer ride, Mystic Timbers. It is looking a little cloudy, um, so we're going to try and get on most of the rides. I don't know if it's supposed to storm or rain, but we're going to do as much as we can in hopes that it does not rain. So we're going to keep making our way towards the back. We're waiting to get on Mystic Timbers. New ride. Here we go. Hi. We just got off of Mystic Timbers. That ride was awesome. It was the fastest that ride I've so ever That was so fast, on. but so fun. I would ride that again. I don't understand the ending of it. Yeah, I don't know. You just kind of sit there in like a dark shed. It looks like you're gonna feel like there's more ride. But um, there's not. But there's not. It's just the end. It was weird. Yeah, so we are gonna ride the beast next. That was fun. After we get some water. Yeah, we're gonna get some water, ride the beast. We'll see you there. Ah. Now we're headed on to the beast. Look at all these little track marks. Well, we just got off the beast. Um, I don't know if I would ride that again. I am in a lot of pain. I have a lot of bruises. Yeah, um, it's very rough. It's a, it's a fun ride, but it's it's a wooden roller coaster if you if you don't know what it is. But it was very rough, so I don't know if I'd ride that again. No. Um, so far, the only ride that I think I would ride like multiple times in one trip is Mystic Timbers. I don't know. I like the Banshee too. That was the first one. Okay, so yeah, you like the Banshee. And right now we're actually gonna go on that ride. I think it's called the Diamondback. Yeah. And other than that, the only one we haven't ridden is the Invertigo. But other than that, we've been able to get on literally everything. And it's only, I think, 3 o'clock. So it's Memorial Day weekend. I'm shocked. I thought it was going to be, like, super busy. But it's not. It's, it's really hot. It's, like, 90 degrees out. But, um, but we're having a really good time. So we're going to go ride the Diamondback and maybe get on some of the other rides that we've already been on. Lego. So we're about to get on Diamondback and I just wanted to point this out because I've never seen this before. But the train, so like the odd number seats are close together and then the even seat numbers are like farther apart. And it's like that throughout the whole train. 
So it's kind of cool. Sorry. We just got off a Diamondback. It was so much fun. I was scared because it just has a lot bar. But, but it, it was good. It doesn't go upside down. So no. It just, I would definitely ride that one again. It just felt like I wasn't safe because there was nothing on the side of me. But it was really fun. Yeah. If it wasn't like a 45 minute wait, I would ride it again. But maybe next time. Maybe next time. So we just got off a of flight of fear. It's the indoor ride right there behind us. That was very similar to Rock and Roller Coaster yeah. at Hollywood Studios. A lot more rough though. Yes. So that kind of hurt. Yeah. yeah. So I think we might be done for the day. We do have a, a three hour plus ride home and we were able to get on everything we wanted. So. Except for the canyon. Oh yeah, except for the the water ride, the canyon thing. That's okay. But um, yeah, all in all, it was a really good day. We had a really good time, good weather, except for like the 20 minutes that it rained, but we just kind of walked around the gift shops during that time, so. But uh, yeah, I think it's time to go home. Yeah. Time to go home and take a shower. Yes. Yes. We are on our way back home. We spent all day at Kings Island. We could have stayed later, but we we did everything we wanted to, and we do have a three-hour drive home, so we're on our way home. We had a great time. Um, the only thing I would say, compared to like Cedar Point, it's very difficult to find the entrance to some of the rides. Some like there was a few where we like ended up walking in a giant circle because it was kind of confusing. But other than that, like we had a really good time, perfect weather, really good food, um, and we would definitely come back. Um, what do you think? It was really, really good. She had a good time. She's tired. Um, and we are planning to go to Cedar Point sometime in the next couple months. So maybe we'll do like a little comparison after we go there. Yeah. Yeah. We went last year, but we didn't really get to ride a whole lot. Because, um, you know, it's generally a lot busier. Which kind of shocked me because they're under the same company, Kings Island and Cedar Point. But, and they also have some similar rides, both of the parks. But Kings Island, like, the busyness compared to Cedar Point was, like, not even the same. Like, we, the longest ride that we had to wait for was, like, 45 minutes. And that was the very last and ride. And that was, like, oh, the very last ride that we rode. Other than that, we maybe waited 10, 20 minutes for most of the rides. So we got really lucky. And especially for it being a holiday weekend, um, I was not expecting that. So... Yeah, I would definitely come back. A lot of fun. And thank you guys for watching. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. So we're driving home from Kings Island. And first of all, you can't tell the difference between my skin and my shirt because I'm so freaking burnt. But we stopped at Starbucks. I don't like coffee, but Jenna wants me to try this. So here we go. Oh my god. Oh, that tastes like shit. What is this? It's a gold brew. It's a gold hazelnut. brew. Oh my god, coffee's the worst. <laughs> okay, there you go. This is for Jenna.